Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the True Rock and Roll Podcast. As usual, I'm here with King Edward and Sue Ann Carwell. We had a little hiatus, but we're back. And we got a special show for you today. We got a surprise. Let's listen to Rufus and Shaka Khan singing, I'm a woman and I'm a backbone. And then we got a surprise for you after that. All right, y'all, let's get started. I'm telling you, but girl, that that feather halter top. When I saw her in the feather halter top and those buckskin pants, I had to have me a feather halter top. <laughs> when I met you, you looked like her. You were little like her and had the hair out there, and I was like, That's yeah. Crazy. My cousin used to say when he was little, he's about three years old. He used to say, he used to say, "That's Andrea." He would point at her album cover and say, "That's Andrea." Right. Yeah, yeah, you look like We had like the same, that. yeah, we did. Little we shape did. and everything. Uh, what you if think, only King? it was still true. Yes, that was a hell of a year when she put that out. Mm. And uh, everybody was dressing really, uh, you know, hippish, I would say. Yeah, because yeah. you know, I, I was having all, all kind of stuff like that on as well. A lot of that, yeah, a lot of that wear came from uh, uh, Johnny Guitar Watson, the fringes and leather, or, and, and, I mean, or Sly. Sly, right. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sly, yeah. they all started wearing it, you know. That's right, and, that's uh, right, that's right. So, I was yeah, listening I mean, to Johnny Guitar Watson yesterday, too. You, but anyway, let's you, get back to it, because we got a surprise after that, okay? Oh, I can't wait. Yeah. yeah.
what I want to do is make his work man. Yeah. Two months ago, I yeah. introduced to the American public a group called Rufus, and we certainly feel like we had a lot to do with the success of Rufus, and it really gives us a great pleasure to present them with their very first gold album, Rufus and Chaka Khan. Yeah. Yeah. an awful lot to get a gold record nowadays and I know you feel good about it don't you Chuck? Oh for sure for sure and we'd like to thank everybody involved uh, the Midnight Special Bob <laughs> Ellis uh, Donnie Sharada Otis Smith and Jay Lasker <laughs> Would you do another song for us? Sure. How awesome man A lot of people don't know that you know in our age that the drummer Andre Fisher was you know, the one that brought Natalie Cole back. You know, really? He ended, and he ended up marrying her, you know, when she got, because, you know, Natalie was into the whole addiction drug thing and mm -hmm. she got clean and she met Andre Fisher and married him. And he's the one who did that. Do you remember that video that she did with her father? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. The remix, he, right. He, he produced and oh, put that, that whole beautiful. thing together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Unforgettable. Yeah. yeah I met, he did met, met him back in the day. Uh, you know, I booked uh, I booked her here in Dallas at the Fairmont Hotel mm. with, with dinner and champagne. Oh, it was a real, yeah. real nice show, you know. But she, All was right. really, she was really out of it back then, too, as well, you know. Mm. But, uh, right. Well, yeah. King, I got a surprise. Something we found today. The only other person that could sing this song beside Chaka Khan is sitting right next to you. So <laughs> let's go ahead and show that.
Yes. Minnesota great. Uh, Our best was... friend, Sue Ann. Nobody could sing that song. That's why Rufus asked her to come yes. out with that. Because they know that. It was yeah. wonderful. Where was that, Sue Ann? Well, that was, that was actually a test run. We were getting ready to do 10 dates in Japan. But so okay. we were at SIR in LA, but that was just like we did a free concert for anybody who wanted to come because we wanted to make sure, you know, it was going, we wanted to make sure it was going to be yes. uh, cool. It was going to rock. Right. And then uh, if you look, if you look on your own time, you'll see a uh, Sly comes up. Because Sly did the tour with us. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll try and see if I can find that. Whenever, you know, whenever well, you whoever can, that yeah. was that recorded that on their cell phone, thank you so much. Yeah, that was, that was, uh, that was my girl. I, 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 well, no, I don't, wait, I don't remember who that was, but uh, you had um, the background singers were dope. I mean, you had Shaka's daughter, Malini. You had Tony uh -huh. Maiden's daughter who could sing. You had my girl, Madam D, who was singing, and Val Young from, um, uh, who did live and die in LA is a place to be. She did that and plus she did a lot of Snoop stuff, but she has now, she does the Mary Jane girls. Yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. But those singers were some great singers, man. Yeah. Really? But there's a, whole, you. there's a whole story behind that whole thing. And I'll, and when the book comes out, you'll hear about it. Okay. Well, we'll be looking for that. Thank anyway, you. everybody, Thank give you. us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah. You know that button underneath? If it doesn't say subscribe, yes. past tense, you are not subscribed, so please subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you know when we're putting out another video. And thanks yes. for joining us. We'll see you Thank next you. time. Mwah. Ciao.